Welcome back to the channel, ladies and gentlemen. This is Manny from Manny B Investing MBI, and we're going to take a look at Telegram PBX Traders. Make sure you hit that like on the way in, please, and subscribe. We are almost to our thousand subscriber goal. I would really appreciate it if you supported the channel by hitting that subscribe button, hitting the like, and sharing this video. Let's take a look at the PBX Traders chat on telegram it's a great place to be if you want to hang out uh, learn about learn about the project learn about trading uh, all of that good stuff but i wanted to focus on the types of people that are beginning to show up reality trader i just bought pbx at one cent someone here think a 40 cent possible for this cycle this coin seems dead without Cardano. First off, red flag right there. You, you're you saying that you purchased it and you're immediately asking for a price prediction from a bunch of strangers and then at the same time trashing the token. There's nothing that makes me believe that this person has purchased any PBX whatsoever. Uh, Coin's been out less than six months, to my knowledge. No working product, no Binance, Coinbase listing. So, John Jones hit him with some facts. Uh, MVP not released. Uh, do you confirm is dead? Kindly see chart on Cardano. First time how many months before moon? It's not always launch, have quick pump to the sky. If it does, we can't buy this cheap. <laughs> the best stage and range way while the team is working on the product uh we could buy as much as possible before fly the project and the team is solid no doubt for this just be patient well these these people aren't here to be patient they're here to troll fud and spam or market other projects uh yeah why not but we need working product and more listings first mvp will be will be launched this quarter uh this q1 it's like a beta of the actual product uh, this project is very nice. Wish it was on Solana or something, but I still bought a lot at one cent. I'm selling it at 25 cents. It shouldn't be hard. I also bought a lot of RNDR. Don't know what the hell that is. Render token in PBX. And pick a crypto, a website using support resistance trend lines moving. Oh, man. <laughs> one of these guys. We think the price could reach somewhere around 10 to 40 cent USD mark. Uh, in the next few months. That is interesting. Um, that would be cool, but I, I mean, it's possible. MVPs come in, you know, that is possible. I don't think that that is ridiculous. Uh, my extensions uh, had shown like between five and 10 cents, uh, five cents being the lower extreme on the zone, uh, 10 being the upper uh, but I mean, anything is possible. It just comes down to people buying and people selling the pressure. Um, but this is funny. I like these articles where it's like, they like make these articles and they're like, Hey, buy this token. We're not going to tell you anything technical about it other than, uh, lines on a, uh, on a chart, squiggly lines on a chart. Um, it's going to moon, moon boy, moon boy. It's just silly. And it's in, and it's irresponsible. Honestly, honestly, uh, this is a top 50 coin. It's a token. Um, I don't know if this is true, but I see 40 cents at of year. Okay. Um, not if Cardano thing don't happen. What Cardano thing? Uh, we need Cardano then. Yes. It will be on Cardano. Burr, if we can still do 50 cent with ADA. I don't even know what he's talking about. Is he talking about it migrating to Cardano blockchain natively? Uh, no way. He's saying no way. When? Like this cycle, I hope. Did this guy even look at the roadmap? They built it on Ethereum first. It's easier. And it's not easier. It's just possible. Uh, and then port it to Cardano. This year on Cardano. I don't, I don't know what the heck who this guy is. Um, not if Cardano keeps lying and delaying things. Lying and delay, delays what? Perfect. Because they effing lie at the end. But... So this guy is probably just a Solano uh, troll, is what I'm imagining. Because uh, they, F, um, but overall, I love this project too much. 
and R and D R even more. But so now he's mentioned this twice. Weird. Why no one talks about this coin on YouTube. Isn't it waiting for something big to happen? Then I notice it because of ETH fees. Yeah, I think because it's very early, there's nothing to show actually. Okay, perfect. I see a small per predicted for PBX if they do Cardano at end of cycle. I found this month last two months ago. What? Can't figure out a price peaks because that's not how the world works, sir. I think it is a top 100 coin easily. That means a 35X at least. But when, it's difficult to say. It can be one to three years, I think. Top 50 is a 90X at least. Hello. Oh, it's when you're saying hello. Okay, okay. TA only thing I could have found about this coin was a 40 cent short term. I don't know if that price is with Cardano thing or without it. It's not with anything. This is based on just some squiggly lines on a freaking web page. Um, but if we can go to 25 cents, it would be uh, good already for me, I think. It's all guesses. Exactly. I'm a very short term guy on crypto. Well, you're going to get wrecked. Uh, not for me. I find coin that I know they could. But PBX, it's because of Cardano. It's not even on Cardano. What is he talking about? 40 cents equals 35x top 100. Think I need, think it needs one to three years. And then he posts this BS crappy screenshot of a bunch of random nonsense. Top, top picks for 2022. Render token, 10x potential. Cello, 10x potential. Just garbage. 4x potential. Yeah, they said that last year. Uh, dun, dun, dun. Uniswap 10x potential. Yeah, I guess it's possible. Um, hacking token. Just a bunch of nonsense. Crypto exchanges I use. Oh my gosh, these people. Following these like marketers on freaking TikTok probably is where they got that. Cardano is lagging with the slow network right now. No, what? Hopefully they can speed up transactions so Paribus can finally launch a migrate. Okay. I never got into Cardano. I'm learning the story now. Big news, ETH merge is coming. And with it, the staking will be 9 to 12% return, which will attract people away from ADA. So he's fudding. Um, ETH merge? What is an ETH merge? Is he talking about a fork? Is he talking about Ethereum 2.0? Which is supposed to have been coming for, I don't know, the last year? Still not ready? They're saying maybe 2024, maybe 2025? Uh, that they lied and all. That is why I believe ADA holders went ham. But the coin will surpass people in November 2022. And he's got his magic chart here. What is this? Crypto total market cap. Oh, this is the total market. Okay. 40, okay. I can hit a billion, which would be 40x from here when BTC hits over 100k. Moon boy, moon boy talk. The cycle is peaking at 8 trillion plus. I said that last year. It can hit a billion. I saw this also look. What? No dollar PBX would be great, but if it hit 40 cents and BTC is over 100k, I'll be sending half to staking ETH on Rocket Pool. So now they're talking. There's two people. I think these two people are working together. One to twenty dollars if Cardano, but next cycle, yeah. This is all guesses, man. Ha 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 ha. I think 50, but nobody knows. True, but still. I hate getting in a coin where it's two of a guess. It's all guesses. I can see this at a dollar of Cardano, the cycle. He keeps saying the same thing over and over again. If not 50 cent without it. I thought he said 40. Can't even keep his prices straight. The interoperability does make it more chain agnostic. They don't know anything about that, Brian. They literally don't even know what you're talking about. These are, these are pump boys. These are moon boys. Might be Ethereum and Solana trolls too. Then go all in ETH and stake on Rocket Pool. Pumping another 
another platform again. Safest bet in crypto. I'm in RNDR right now, heavy. Are we allowed to talk about other coin? You've been talking about another coin since you've gotten here. Why are you concerned now? Any link on its website? Never heard of it. Yeah, why not? Now they're literally spamming. What is this crap? This is moon boy garbage. This is trash. Trash, trash, trash. Look at this. Easily 20x. Three reason why render could easily 20x. Moon boy nonsense. Become a Patreon. I thought you were going to make money off of render. Why do, you need, why do you need a Patreon? And then, of course, you know, I come back and I read and I'm like, this. it's Bill. Honestly, it's Bill. Three groups. Dude was talking trash and pump. $1. He keeps talking. He keeps shilling Rocket Pool and Ethereum, and the other guy is just. I'm getting rid of both of them. Toxic people. Let's delete it. Delete all from this user. Report spam. Bond user. Oops. Let's make sure it's the right people. Bill. Yeah. Someone get rid of Bill. He's spamming. He's fudding. He's talking about, he's talking trash about Cardano. They're talking trash about Erebus. Delete. Now the reality trader. Total ridiculous. Ban user. Report as spam. Delete all from this user. Delete. Good night. All gone. This is the community. I do a little bit of cleaning up every now and then. Um, but for the most part, it's a great community. We have good discussion. Um, we have a good time. We learn. And I use the trolls, I use the spammers to teach new people a lesson, to onboard them into a place like Telegram, um, just so that you keep, you keep a, an open mind, understand the atmosphere and the types of people, the characters that are in these groups, and what, they're, what they're doing, uh, and what they're trying to do. A lot of times they're trying to fake you out to make you think that they're really interested in a project that you're, you're in the chat room for, and then they start shilling another project because their project isn't real and they need people to buy it so that their bags get pumped Then they can dump them on you and then they can make money and then they move on to the next fake project and they keep doing the same thing and they go around and they just spam chat rooms. They, they create these bogus YouTube videos by all these unknown people that you've never seen before. And they just spam and spam and spam all over the place, all over the internet. Um, so that's what a lot of these people do. Uh, just don't believe this stuff, especially when you start seeing like, like I, like I had shown you all of the, the screenshots with the Microsoft logo and Facebook. Microsoft has jumped in. Microsoft is partner. Microsoft isn't partnering with any of these, these things like, give me a break. It's not, it's not going to happen. It hasn't happened. Uh, it's just not the way it works. So be careful out there. I'm going to do my best to educate uh, and show you guys the way, but be careful out there. Uh, don't listen to everybody you see. If you have any questions or anything, just hit me up, uh, message me. Uh, I'm not really responsive on Telegram just because I can't see all the messages. Um, the best place to reach out to me, the comment section of my videos and on Twitter for sure. I get notifications over there. So uh, hit me up, but uh, make sure you hit the like and thank you for watching the video. Hit that like, hit that share, subscribe, and we'll see you on the next one. Peace.